Hey everyone, welcome. This is Tybius and we are in Minecraft 1.16.4. How you doing? I'm doing pretty good. We have a little house here that we have built. Um, actually, uh, I had a video that I brought us to this point and uh, when I went and looked back at it, there was no volume on it. So we are having to do re redo number one for you. However, we are going to take it off from here because all we've basically done is built this little house, found this, this area on the map. We're going to be building in this area and probably this whole area here. Um, not this much, this, this little area because this is more or less a big hill. But it's a nice little area. We've got a big village that's, hap that's happening up here. And, uh, yeah, it's a big map. We did, do have jungle in this area, which is great. Uh, we were able to get some bamboo. So uh, we built this little house just to shelter us from any evils that are lurking around. And um, we did do a little bit of mining. Got down to, down to bedrock. So that's basically what we did in the first episode. That was a no go, no keep, not a keeper, not a keeper. So uh, let me tell you a little bit about what this, what we're planning on doing in this series. Um, we are using basically some very, uh, very mild stuff, such as in the top right corner, you can see uh, a map of sorts. I can't remember what what it's called. Not the uh, not journey maps, but uh, it is a, a map system, and it works pretty good. Um, we also have JEI, and uh, as you can see here, we have a shoot. Now that comes from the create mod. We have the create mod in here, and the create mod may, it gives you all kinds of tools. To do things, to make things, to make automation, to fabricate stuff, to power generation. And that's what we're going to start off with today. Uh, I have built a couple of things here. We have right here a mechanical press. Now to make the mechanical press it's basically one block of iron and a site casing which is made from one log six pieces of plank two pieces of andesite alloy which the andesite alloy is the andesite two pieces of andesite and two pieces of iron nugget those together with the block of wood and the, the uh, planks of any type and that makes your and makes four andesite casings. You need one of those for the uh, press itself, plus an andesite alloy for this. So that's three pieces of andesite alloy altogether. Plus these require one each. So there's five pieces of andesite alloy, buttons to make the cog wheel. So very easy to make. Very easy early game stuff to do. What you'd basically do is Place the, the press up here like so. Okay, so we're going to make ourselves a hand crank. Basically up there we need uh, some more planks and a shaft. The hand crank and voila, we have hand crank. So we put the hand crank on there. Throw iron or other metal down underneath it and crank it and it creates iron sheet oh so, okay and we're going to be using that in a very short time so um that's one of the mods that we're going to be using now i have to remove this for a second because we're we found a better way to do this. We can make a 
power by the secondary method using a water wheel. Do that next. Now the water wheel, all it's basically made of, let's take a quick look here, is a large cog wheel, which is an andesite alloy. So you have one andesite alloy, four pieces of plank, and four buttons. Makes two cog wheels. And then with that and planks of any type, you make a water wheel. We are going to place that right here. Yeah. Right here. Let's go and place that water wheel. I've got two of them. We're going to put them both up. We have a bunch of glass. We are going to cover it up. So, 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 and let's put a couple of stairs here. That get up there. Uh, we've got a little water here. Up, up, up. Okay, now, I could place the water right here, but what's going to happen is it's going to go the wrong way. So in order to make it go the right way, we're going to take a couple of planks and place them on the bottom portion of that window. That. It'll glitch a little bit, but that's okay. It's It will still work. And then you place the water there. That's going to go the right way. Go like so. Grab a second one. You will need water going on each one because right now it's only using the one power. Let's go there. That is going to give us a little more power. And then we're going to cover it up. There we go. Okay, so our water wheel is working. Okay, now, I'm going to actually open this up where the water wheel is, take a shaft, and add the shaft to the end there, extending it out. And we can extend this as far as we want, but we don't need it that far. <laughs> Uh, let's take our pick, go like this, go, now we're going to take our mechanical press and place it right on there. And as you can see, it's turning, but because there's nothing underneath it, the press won't operate. You can actually go like this. Throw one under there and it'll automatically sense that it's there and create it. So there we've made our first first actual automated tool. And uh, yeah, kind of nifty. <laughs> so um, if you like this video, please do hit that like button and uh, be sure to subscribe hitting the uh, notification bell so that you're notified when the next video comes out. I'm going to try to put in as many videos on this create mod as I possibly can. Some are going to be two parters uh, because they are some of the uh, structures that we're going to be building are going to be pretty big. So um, yeah, this is the create mod and uh, I hope that you enjoyed it please do hit that like button and be sure to comment down below let me know what kind of contraptions you'd like me to build so until next time this is tyvius signing off have yourself a fantastic rest of your day bye for now